These are the little buggers you gotta be careful of. They are pack rats. Welcome to Tigner Adventures. <laughs> we have spent our first night boondocking since we left Sundance RV Resort in, in uh, Yuma. So we are now officially started our trip. Uh, last night's sunset was beautiful. That was really cool. And today we are actually um, going to uh, take off and go down to Oregon Pipe Cactus National Park. So we're gonna go visit that and everything. So anyway, so come along and let's go see what this park's all about. We are at the visitor center and it's a small visitor center, but it's going to be kind of fun. We're going to go inside, kind of look around a little bit. And then as soon as we're done with the visitor center, we're going to actually go across the road and go on the Ajo Mountain Drive, which is about a two hour drive one way up to the mountains. And so we'll kind of see what's going on up there. And there's a couple hikes up there that we'll probably take too. Yeah, this is pretty interesting. Yeah. Got a lot of nice little stuff around. So this is a pretty nice little visitor center inside and they actually go through quite a few little examples to show things. They've got this uh, little video playing. Uh, the main auditorium is closed and so uh, you have to look at that uh, media presentation online. These are the little buggers you got to be careful of. They are pack rats. They build these big nests. They love collecting everything, including the wiring on your vehicle. That's what happened to me back in Quartzsite. Just outside the visitor center, they have this little quarter mile walk that just goes out through all the vegetation. Talks about um, how the desert um, grows and the, the nightlife, all the animals, and their habitat. Okay, well, we have finished um, going through and looking at things here at the what was, Oregon, Oregon Pipes, Pipes Cactus National Park. So a lot of different cactuses, and this is what it's named after, is this one cactus here. It uh, looks like an Oregon Pipe. So lots of those around, and uh, a lot of scoras, lots of different uh, animals. So it was a fun little visit. Uh, we uh, didn't go on the big road. Uh, trip because we um, are completely full so we decided maybe we'll wait until this um, fall when we come back for the winter time right now it's getting really hot out and so there's not a lot of guests here and the campground is pretty much empty and so that's the big deal <laughs> is uh, at this time of year things get hot and so was there anything specifically you seen that you liked I mean she did find a cactus that had a flower on yes, it yes we finally found a flowering cactus and also, we were looking at the cactuses and imagining them as people. <laughs> They're pretty funny. Yeah. 
A lot of, uh, I mean, the Segoras have all different kinds of shapes to them, so like they're pretty some fun. Some running away, some hugging. Some. Yeah, <laughs> so. So the road that goes through the National Park actually goes from Gila, Gila Bend down through, it's 85, down to uh, Rocky Point in New Mexico. So there is a border crossing just down here. And for some New reason. Mexico, not New Mexico. Oh, Desert New Mexico. Yes. Mexico. <laughs> so, really Mexico. Another yeah, real country. Mexico. Yeah, another country. So anyway, um, the road is really, really busy this weekend. So I'm guessing the only thing I can think of, because we're talking to the border agents and stuff, they said there's a lot of traffic today and a lot of it is uh, going back to the state. So we're guessing that everyone is coming back from Rocky Point. Rocky Point is right on the Sea of Cortez. And so they're probably coming back as probably spring break or something that we're not really aware of because we're retired. So, but anyway, we're starting our trip out here. So it's been fun. We'll come back and see this uh, when the weather cools off in the winter. And uh, up until then, we'll just, uh, we'll start working on uh, just taking it easy since we've been working camping so long. And uh, we're just gonna uh, kind of hang out today and then take off tomorrow for the next portion of our journey. So. Uh, thanks for coming along. Thanks for subscribing and uh, supporting us. And uh, we appreciate all that, really. So anyway, so until next time, we'll just uh, plan on seeing you down the road. And if we don't, then we'll just see you on our next video. So take care.